50% off. That's why I love <laughs> the Gucci outlet. So many beautiful mamans. They are gorgeous. Perfect for Valentine's Day. These two bags I like. Little wicker bag. Guys, this is such a beautiful book tour. Here they have a the purple little classic black Saint Laurent bag. Yeah. They have gorgeous pink bags, right? to a very spontaneous little vlog. Um, first, caffeine, obviously. It's still relatively early in the morning. I have decided to go to Vista Village today um, because I still don't have a dress for the premiere. You guys know I'm gonna travel to Berlin soon to go to Dacob, Super Dacob's premiere of his Vivian Westwood documentary, Art Lovers Unite. I don't have a dress yet and I swear like I was looking for dresses for weeks now whenever I don't need a dress or anything I find so many and when I actually need something like Murphy's Law you know you don't find anything obviously so yeah today we're gonna go to Bista maybe we're gonna find a nice little Gucci dress that would be my dream let's see what else we find it's a beautiful day cheers and let's go and yes guys I didn't even have time to put makeup on today because I was just rolling out of bed thinking, let's go to Bista Village. <laughs> Cheers, guys! My life elixir. And we are here, guys. So I would say let's go to Gucci first, like we always do. And hopefully we're gonna find something. There we are, Gucci. I would say let's see what's on the window display. Then we're gonna go in, try on some things. Hopefully find a nice bag, a nice dress. <laughs> so I think these are like classical Gucci outlet pieces. Um, you will always find these collections um, in the outlets. Uh, some pieces are actually made specifically for the outlets, guys. So, you know, I think that's quite interesting. And then, of course, you have um, some pieces like these, which have been in the boutiques and they haven't sold. And then, you know, they ship them here. Some nice little GG clutch bags. Okay, let's go in. Oh, and they have these as well. They're quite cool. Some mamons. We have some special edition Gucci pieces here. Still from the year of the tiger. Now it's the year of the bunny, the year of the rabbit. You guys know I have rabbits. <laughs> so I laugh that they come out with so many rabbit themed bags at the moment. Oh wow guys, look at these treasures. <gasps> I can't believe they are in the outlet. Let's see how much they actually cost. Can we see that? We have to definitely try those on. Oh wait guys, it's so difficult with one hand. Oh, down to 2,000 from four. So, you know, because it's an exotic piece, obviously, um, they are very expensive. So it's 50% off, guys. Let's see. Let's have a look at this one as well. Yeah, 2,000 as well. Oh my God, okay, let's try this on. Okay, guys, so here we are with the beautiful Python bag. <gasps> Oh my god, you know, 50% off. That's why I love <laughs> the Gucci outlet. It's so incredible. Which one do we like more? This one or rather the other one? Let me show you the other one as well. Another quick close up, guys. I can't believe I just came in and I've already fallen in love with this one. It is stunning. It's so vintagey, right? And it's another grandma bag, but I love it because I can still wear it when I'm like age 90, right? So this is the other Python bag. Oh, and I love it as well. Hmm. Should we take one of these home? So I really like this one. Let me know which one's better. I believe they have an ostrich one as well. <laughs> oh wow. I really like them. The colors are amazing. Oh, this is the green one. I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> what can I tell you? These lizard pieces are really gorgeous too. Can't find the price unfortunately but it comes with um, the sides, obviously, so that you can travel with the bag. Okay, this one looks awesome with my coat, right? Wow, look at these python pieces. Gorgeous, so many exotics. And even crocodile pieces. <laughs> well, hello. This is gorgeous. This crocodile bag is reduced by 7,000 pounds, so from 25 to 18,000. I love this mechanism. That's how you close the bag. It's really, oh, 
Such a beautiful piece. Okay, look at this one. They have so many gorgeous bags, so many exotics. There we can see the price, 27 reduced by a thousand pound. I have one Dionysus bag and I absolutely love it. It's so, it sits so comfortable and you can open it so easy and close it again. I love Dionysus bags. These are the other exotic pieces that they have. Oh, this bag is really stunning as well. Guys, even so many beautiful mamans. And these colors are perfect for spring, right? I really love this print with the little flowers. Oh, it comes with such a special box. This is beautiful. I always wanted to have a nine, still be 1969. Black, black crocodile is obviously very tempting. So this is 50% off as well. Um, down from 16, from 16,000 to 8,000 for a crocodile bag, guys. This is quite tempting, right? And look at the shine. It's not really shiny alligator. It's not really mud either. It's like a mix between the two. <gasps> My heart is melting. Wow. Yeah. This is such a beautiful, subtle gray. There we can see from, oh wow, from 17,600 down to eight. Okay, that is quite some savings you would have right here. Oh, this looks so good with my coat as well, right? <laughs> oh, I always wanted to have an alligator bag and like this is over 50% off, guys. Oh, this is so gorgeous. Okay, it comes in red as well. This is gorgeous. I mean, it goes so well with my coat today. This bag as well guys okay let's look at some dresses oh look at this valentine's collection what is this is this a bag <laughs> never seen this shape before oh, they are gorgeous perfect for valentine's day oh, look at this i've never seen this before i know they made a lot of crazy dionysus bags in the past um, but never ever have i seen this not in real life not on fashion file it's quite cool, it's quite heavy guys, but beautiful. This is a beautiful classic Gucci bag as well. Love it. Okay, let's see if they have anything for the premiere. Um, they had so many dresses last time. Oh, this is quite cool. How much is the sweater with like here, the feathers um, on the sleeves? Oh, 700 pounds. But red doesn't really suit me, unfortunately. Um, Let's see if they have dresses. Actually got this sweater um, in blue as well. Oh, I love the feathers. That's very Gucci, right? Um, this is a nice coat as well. So I found a really nice SA. He's actually looking for some boom dresses for me for the premiere. Let's see what he finds. I'm really drawn towards these. They have it in pink as well. That's quite cool. It's obviously not for the premiere, but just for like every day. That's a nice, whoo, that's a nice sweater. I wanna have a look at what kind of jewelry pieces they have as well. Um, some rings. This is actually from the last collection. I already have it here. Okay guys, so we're gonna try these dresses. How awesome are they? <laughs> Usually I prefer dresses with a neckline though, but that's what they have at the moment. This is only a thousand pound, guys, for a Gucci dress. And it's like new collections, where well, the latest collections, and they've arrived in the outlet now. I love the shimmer of this. I can't really close this dress. <laughs> it's too difficult to close um, by myself. But it, it it's not my kind of style. It doesn't it doesn't fit properly. I think it actually is a little bit too big up here. <laughs> it's a UK size eight, which is usually my size. But I think in this dress, um, I could even wear a size six. I guess, but yeah, it's, it's, well, it's very shiny, you know, that's what it is. Look at this, but it's not what I'm looking for, I think. Same with this one, <laughs> it's not really my style. I can't close it either, like, it's, these are so difficult to close. I need somebody else to help you, and can you, can you hear the noises that this latex dress makes? <laughs> so, yeah, it's not for me. I love the feathers on the sleeve. I'm definitely a sucker for feathers on sleeve, but yeah, too much latex. <laughs> Okay, he has just shown me this beautiful bag as well. So that's all the colors they have. The black, the blue, the gray, and they have a red as well, but I said he doesn't need to bring it out. Um, yeah, okay. No dress at Gucci. And in case you wanted a close up of this bag as well. It's a beautiful color. The gold really pops against the blue. 
I think I still prefer the grey. Okay guys, so that was Gucci. That's what I mean, Murphy's Law. Like last time I was here, they had so many gorgeous dresses, but I didn't need one, you know? And they would have all been suitable for the premiere. And now they don't have anything really. I'm just unlucky. Seems like Dior is closed. I think they're transforming this into like a big Dior um, store here. So, okay, let's go to the next shop. Let's have a quick look at Alexander McQueen. Because um, sometimes they have really nice dresses as well, but I didn't find anything. But this clutch is pretty cool, isn't it? Versace. Okay, let's definitely go and have a look at Versace. Because I'm a newly um, won over fan of their bags. <laughs> this is quite cool. I think I'm just drawn to it because it's so bright pink. I just like the color, I think. That's the same bag and the same material, just a little bit like toned down in terms of the colors. Which one do you prefer? That's quite cute as well. I like it because of the thick, chunky hardware. What do we think about like a so black bucket bag? You know, it's a little bit more understated. Bottega Veneta next. I just love their bags. Look at these. I have never seen them in the boutiques. What is this model called? Honestly, guys, I've never seen these bags before. Nice little shoulder pouch. This is just like the regular pouch size-wise, but it has like this little shoulder strap. Well, not shoulder strap, strap. <laughs> Look at these tiny little pouches. Cute. There we have some small size ones. Oh, the beautiful, like the leather quality is so superb. Guys, look at this. <gasps> so cute. This is like a little sheep. <laughs> I've never seen these bags. How fluffy and cute are they? I've never seen any of these models. Like, I wonder if they were specifically made for the outlets as well. Let's have a quick look at Prada as well. Prada has Mew Mew pieces as well. Um, Oh, I'm always drawn to sparkly things. Look at these. Oh, love them. Love bucket bags. They have a lot of shiny, sparkly things this time. Wow. Pretty, huh? What do we think about this one? That's like a little towel. <laughs> Cute. Um, classic Prada bags. Um, but I have to be honest, nothing that really caught my eye. Okay, we have to go into Vivian Westwood, obviously, to see if we find a piece of hers for the premiere. It smells so good here, it smells like crepes. Maybe I should get a crepe with Nutella. Quick look in the window display. They have this beautiful bag with a flower print and this bucket bag as well. This is obviously all still original Vivian Westwood, what's in the outlets currently. Um, we don't know in what direction the brand is moving to now. Um, that she has passed. They moved Fendi up here. Um, they changed the position of the store. That dress is pretty cool. And look at the sunglasses with the FF logo. These two bags I like. Little wicker bag. Oh. These are cool. And these I've seen like a year ago in Dubai. <laughs> now they're in the outlet. These put my eye as well with a little python up here. He plays with a queue, <laughs> Dior. They actually do have a Dior boutique. I would say let's queue up and get a first glimpse. Um, can we see? Oh, the reflection is so bad. Can we see <laughs> the necklace there with the pearls? Can get a first glimpse at what they have. I think we should try on that book tour. That is really pretty. Guys, this is such a beautiful book tour. Yeah, that's part of the job. They immediately stopped me at Dior. <laughs> Okay, let's go and see what else we find. Have a look at Loewe instead. This bucket bag is beautifully made, right? Let's try this one on. And look at this little black mohair pouch. Feels so luxurious. This is something we haven't seen before. <laughs> Almost looks like the Chanel Camellia flowers, right? From afar. It's a really nice bucket bag. I mean, Loewe is also known for their beautiful leather and leather work. Look how much effort must have gone into making these. Must have taken so long to make all of these with little no flowers. Mistakes. If with no <laughs> mistakes. <laughs> so we have it here in pink as well. I think I prefer the black and white. Let me know which one you prefer. It's quite a discount. Valentino. I still don't own any Valentino bags, but I like them. I like the oversized studs and this color is awesome. It's a wool bag. Let's try and find that one. Oh, and there we can already see what other bags they have. Oh, wow. 
I like the Valentino flower bags. So beautiful. They have huge totes. Oh, really stunning. Here is the wool bag in beige. I wonder how much they are. Let's see if we find this. Whoops. 1006 down from 24. Yeah. Especially in the purple wool. I wonder how wool wears though. You know. If anyone has a wool bag, let us know. Leather. Oh, the classic leather bags. This one always reminds me of the Fendi Peekaboo, just the Valentino version. I love the oversized studs. Get this tote as well. Gorgeous. Guys, here they have uh, the purple. Okay, let's see how this one looks like. On me? It's my color. This is really my color. And the gold pops so nicely. Oh, this is, I think, my highlight so far. I really like this bag. A little heart. Valentino bag. Perfect for Valentine's Day. Okay guys, now we're gonna go to Salvatore Ferragamo. I'm always looking forward to Salvatore Ferragamo the most, I think, because um, I absolutely love their bags. Let's go. First, I had to stop for this Balmain bag. Look at it. Oh, I love glittery things. I forgot Saint Laurent, of course. We have to go into Saint Laurent as well. Little classic black Saint Laurent bag. I have this one in this large size as well. And in red. Little fabric bag, grayish. This is gorgeous. This is very understated. You only have this tiny little Saint Laurent print there. This is the black one. This is gorgeous too, with the little YSL designs. Very understated, very vintage -y. Now it's time for Salvatore Ferragamo. So excited. Okay guys, I just came in. You guys know I want a studio bag sooner or later in my collection. I love my Gancini classic top handle bags. Oh, this is a beautiful color. Um, this leather feels like Epsom leather almost. I think it's comparable to Epsom leather. I love the rich gold hardware. Do you like it? I have another pink studio bag. This is Python and leather. That's really gorgeous too. I think I like the other one better. It pops more. Oh, guys, I love this suit dress. Really nice bag as well. The Salvatore Ferragamo logo. And they got that one too with a little bow. This is a gorgeous clutch bag as well. I think you can wear it as a shoulder bag or as a clutch. It's Python too. Lots of nice little pink beauties, right? This hot pink trifolio bag caught my eye as well. They have gorgeous pink bags, right? Um, so this is from the 2022 collection, so it's pretty recent. It's a beautiful shade of hot pink. I love it. And it's down from, I think, 1.8 to 1.1. One one. Same bag and like an orange, a red. The pink is the most gorgeous one. So other beautiful bags. These are a little bit more modern, right? It's like the puffy trend. And then we have this, this, and this one. Yeah, I'm definitely drawn towards this color. I love the little bucket bags. You know, if I wasn't wearing, can I wear it as a shoulder bag with a thick winter coat even? It's difficult, it works, but I think it looks better in summer. Wow, they have some exotic bags as well. This is like a teeny tiny little studio bag in pink crocodile. And love their flower prints. Another beautiful crocodile bag, even more. Wow, gorgeous. I still want the pink, the baby pink crocodile top handle Gancini bag that we saw in my Salvatore Ferragamo vlog. That one stole my heart. So that was it for today. Um, unfortunately, I didn't find anything. <laughs> Neither was there a bag that really, really caught my attention where I was like, yeah, I'm willing to pay that. Um, I think if the Gucci Python bags, they would have been like a little bit, like if it would have been 70% off, like last time when I got my Gucci bag here, then I would have said, yeah, okay, I'm gonna get it. Um, you know, still 2,100 pound. Yeah, <laughs> yeah um, there were definitely no dresses, so I, I'm still without a dress for the premiere. <laughs> don't know what I'm gonna do. I have to shop my own wardrobe, probably. That's good as well. Okay, guys, so I hope you enjoyed it. 
and uh, yeah if you did give it oh the light is so much better here <laughs> if you did give it a thumbs up uh, subscribe join our little handbag obsessed family here because we all do have the same luxury disease yes we do and i'll see you again soon